guys and welcome back to my channel. We are currently at JFK Airport and we are on our way to St. Lucia for the honeymoon. We have been up since, well actually we never went to bed last night. So we started driving here from Philadelphia at like 1.30 in the morning and we got here at like 4 and our flight boards at 6.15. It's currently like 5 o'clock in the morning. Um, so our flight boards in a little over an hour and then it takes off at 7. And then we will be in St. Lucia by like 11.30ish. We are so tired. So we obviously had to stop and grab Starbucks. And our gate is literally like right next to a Starbucks. So we got so lucky. Um, I got my usual iced coffee with two pumps of sugar-free vanilla and oat milk and I got a croissant just to snack on and get something that was starving just because like I said I've been up since yesterday um, and I grabbed some waters for the plane and yeah I'm just trying to stay awake I'm probably gonna crash on the plane but that's okay I'll wake up nice and refreshed for when we get there and welcome to the honeymoon vlog So we just got to our room. We are finally in St. Lucia, we made it. And our room is insane. I have to give you the tour here. So when we first walk in to the right, here is this big closet with tons of space. So we have like extra pillows, extra blankets, iron, and then we have our safe, luggage rack, ironing board, and then like plenty of hangers to hang up our clothes. I love these doors. I just think that they're really pretty. And then to the left is the bathroom. So pretty standard, but I love this big mirror. <laughs> and I love this artwork on the wall. And then a nice little ledge to keep stuff on. And then this shower is just like to die. And then when we come out, just like the little decor pieces in here, like are so cute, I love it. And then we have our coffee station which I will be using every morning if you know me. And then down below. We have our little cooler, a little fridge. And we can totally just take from it and restock whenever we need. And then just like more storage underneath. And then big TV and this bed. I have to back up. Hi, Vila. As you can see, the bed fits about five pairs of shorts and eight pairs of shirts. 
I, I love the like canopy type bed like this. I think I would want something like that for my house one day. Beautiful nightstands. I love this marble top for the nightstand. Nice full length mirror. Perfect for the outfits. Gotta love that. And we're getting to my favorite part of this entire room. So we have our little seating area here and look what they did for us when we walked in because they knew it was our honeymoon and they gave us this little like setup and welcomed us for our honeymoon. I just thought that was the cutest thing. Little champagne glasses, a whole little moment. And then our view, then we open this. So this is our little seating area and then this is our view. We can literally walk like 10 paces out to the pool. I mean, you guys, this is for life. So this is our home for the next week. This is honeymoon life. So I think now that we're finally like in our room and our luggage just got here, we are going to get changed into our swimsuits and actually go check out the pool. There's actually another one that has a swim up bar and I think we're gonna go hit up that one and get this honeymoon started, just start having fun. And then tonight is a beach party. So we're gonna get back from the pool after we've had a few drinks in us and get showered, get dressed and get ready for dinner and the beach party. So. I hope you guys are enjoying the honeymoon vlog so far because we are definitely enjoying it. <laughs> Good morning you guys and welcome back. Um, today is Sunday so this is day two of the honeymoon. I just woke up. Um, I slept like a rock last night. Um, I didn't even film any part of dinner just because we got ready so fast and then we went to this like cute little Italian restaurant here and then just came back to the room and like immediately crashed. Like, you can tell I still have makeup on. I slept with my makeup last night. I never sleep with makeup on. Like I am such, like I, I'm so OCD about skincare and um, I just, I zonked out last night. Uh, we had such a long travel day. We had been up since Friday morning. So like we never went to bed Saturday night. We just stayed up, went right to the hotel, or right, went right to the airport and it was just like such a long travel day. We were so excited to be here. I feel so blessed that we're able to have this type of honeymoon. And I mean, if you could just see this island, I mean, it's just gorgeous. Um, but it was just such a long day and I ended up with such a headache by the end of the night. I was just like, I, I can't stay up any longer. I just had zero left in me and I, changed into my pajamas and just immediately fell asleep so now it is what time is it 10 26 in the morning um and we went to bed at like i don't know 8 30 and i didn't wake up until just now so if that gives you any idea as to how tired we were so volante just went to go um volante is my husband if you're new here by the way um, Volante just went to go to the gym. They have a little fitness center here and I am enjoying my coffee and I'm just gonna kind of just take a minute to wake myself up and if you can see where I'm sitting. So I'm on my little patio right now that's like right in front of our room and um, I can literally walk to the pool in front of me. So like let me show you what I mean. I can literally like, here's my step, and I can literally walk to the pool in front of me. And this is only one of the pools here, but it's just amazing that like I get to 
wake up to this every morning for the next week. How crazy. So this is my morning this morning. Just thought that I would take a second to have some coffee, a little chit chat, catch up with you guys. And the coffee's okay. It's not like what I'm used to. But it's alright, coffee's coffee, right? Um still grateful, still thankful, still so blessed to be here. Oh my god, I can't and if you can see the mountains that are behind this like it's just insane i have to tell you about some of the things that we have planned this week so what what did i say today is i'm like so all over the place i don't even know what day of the week it is it's just i'm so thrown off so today okay today is sunday so tonight we're just kind of like today and tonight we're just kind of like doing whatever we want um we might sit by the pool we might hang out on the beach, whatever we want to do. Um, dinner, we don't have any reservations anywhere, so we're just gonna pick whatever of the restaurants that we want to go to. Because certain restaurants require reservations, so we don't have any other reservations tonight. And then tomorrow, tomorrow we have a little photo session planned. That was the photo session that I talked about in my um, haul in the previous video, if you haven't seen it. So I packed my rehearsal dinner dress for that um, from the wedding. And uh, we're gonna have some photos taken, which I think will be really, really special. And uh, then at night we have, so we're gonna go to dinner wherever we want Monday night. And then um, on Tuesday, we have a pretty packed day on Tuesday. So on Tuesday, we're doing this like really big tour. We have to be there at 8.45 in the morning and they're taking us around the mountain on a boat, and we get to go see um, like so many different things. It, it's just insane. My cousin did it when he went on his honeymoon, and he actually just wrote me about it. He didn't know that we were doing it. He literally just wrote me. I have to read you what he said. He said, schedule your so free air cruise. Don't do it by land, do it by cruise. It's so much better, and you get free rum punch. Go in the volcano mud hot tub and do waterfall pictures and snorkeling all one trip. Um, and there's actually a little bit more to it too. So I know that like the whole uh, Johnny Depp and Amber Heard for, um, trial just ended. And so there's like a ton of hype around, you know, Johnny Depp and whatnot and the whole Pirates of the Caribbean thing. Now there's talks that he might sign on for the next Pirates movie and all. So. One of the Pirates of the Caribbean movies was filmed in St. Lucia. Um, and they're actually gonna take us around to, there's one scene in one of those movies where Johnny Depp is like saluting the dead, um, the dead pirate, it's like a, it's like a dead pirate hanging somewhere. Um, I'll, I'll see if I can like insert a clip of that particular scene. But they're going to take us around and show us where that part was actually filmed, which will be so cool. And I will definitely take a video of that. And I'm such a Johnny Depp and such a Pirates of the Caribbean fan that like I'm so excited for that. So I'm so looking forward to that whole day tomorrow on Tuesday. It's like from 8.45 until 1.45. And then at night we have dinner at a Japanese restaurant. Um, and then on Wednesday is Wednesday is my 35th birthday, so we're gonna do whatever we want during the day, pool, one of the pools or the beach or whatever. And then we have in the evening we have a two-hour sunset sunset cruise plan. I'm having a really tough time speaking this morning. I need to finish my coffee and then I'll have a better time speaking. I think. Um, <laughs> oh, words are hard. Um, and then after the cruise, as soon as we get back, we need to walk over to our private candlelit dinner on the beach. So that would be my nice little birthday dinner. Uh, we were actually just filling out the menu uh, to figure out like what we each want for that specific dinner. And then that will be my birthday. Um, and actually, so 
really quick rewind. One of the things that they do here is they have like specific themes each night. So like one night it's like a beach party and then another night they'll do something else, like saying something else. And the night of my birthday is um, country night. And it's so fitting for me because country music is like my thing. Um, so I'm really excited for that. Couldn't have fallen on a more perfect day. And then Thursday, which is our last day here because we leave Friday, is, um, let me see, oh, Thursday is our catamaran cruise. So we're taking a six hour catamaran cruise where we'll do like snorkeling um, and some other things like that. But it's, we get to go basically uh, the same thing, like around the, um, around the island. They provide like dinner on board and it's gonna be so much fun. I'm, I'm actually really excited for that one. Um, and that's going to be like a whole day of fun and then we come back and just go to dinner wherever there's no reservations that night so really the only reservations oh no we do have reservations that night that was for another like nice they call it international I don't know what international means unless it's just like food from all over the world and not necessarily like just Italian or just Mediterranean or just French um, so it might just be like a mix of things I don't know stay tuned we'll see so yeah that will be a nice hat day right before we leave and then we leave I think early Friday morning and it is such a long travel day let me tell you so to get from the airport like the, the St. Lucia Airport to this resort. It's an hour and like 40 minute drive. And it's like windy roads the whole time. I actually felt a little car sick on the way here. And so we took a, like a bus or like a shuttle to get here. And so let me give you a little backstory of why the whole travel day is so long. So for us, it was so much cheaper to fly out of JFK in New York. We're from Philadelphia. So we had to drive two hours from Philadelphia to JFK airport. And we left at like 1.45 in the morning because we had to be there at least by four because our flight was leaving by seven in the morning. So that was a really long part. Even just to get to the airport, that made it that much longer. And then the flight was about four hours and then like I said once we got to St. Lucia Airport and then it was that hour 40 minute drive to the actual resort so once we get home on Friday or once it's time to leave on Friday we have to drive an hour and 40 minutes back to the St. Lucia Airport and then fly back to JFK in New York get our car and then drive another to a little over two hours back home. So Friday's gonna be another really long travel day. So when we get home, I'm so glad that we are going home on a Friday so that we have like the rest of the weekend to just kind of like unpack and settle in and relax before we go back to work on Monday. I'm really glad that like I, I decided to book this trip that way. So I feel like I just rambled on for the past 10 minutes with you guys, but. I'm sorry for doing that to you, but if you're still here, thank you and cheers to you. So, but I am just so blessed and so thankful that we are here and I get to celebrate my husband and celebrate our marriage and celebrate my 35th birthday on this trip and just, you know, spend time as a newly married couple because we haven't really had the time to do that yet, you know. We get married back in May, and it is now the end of July. And ever since our wedding, we have just been like go, 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 nonstop. You know, first we moved into my in-laws, and then um, we've just been working nonstop. So I'm really glad that like we are finally taking the time to ourselves to enjoy each other and just really settle into our marriage. And um, it's been it's been so needed, and it's been so refreshing for us. So, I am really, I'm really like taking the time to soak this all in. So, I'm really glad that you guys are here with me and growing this little family on here. I'm going to pause the video here. Um, 
I have no idea how this vlog is going to go, you guys. I don't know where I'm going to be picking up the camera or when. It's just going to be kind of like whenever I feel like it. So you're just going to kind of get little bits here and there of the entire trip. So, but I will see you guys later. Hey guys, so it is now Monday night. We didn't get to do a whole lot today during the day just because it's been like raining off and on all day today, which kind of stinks, but it's okay. Um, tonight though, we are getting ready to head to a scheduled photo shoot, which is really exciting. I am repurposing my dress rehearsal or dinner rehearsal dress. Um, so I will show you in the mirror in a second. Um, but I'm really excited for this. We're just going to kind of take some really nice photos to um, create some memories for this whole trip. Um, hopefully the rain holds out. It looks, the sky looks really gray right now. So, but we're, we're going to bring um, an umbrella with us and make the best of it. And then afterwards we're going to go get dinner and just kind of enjoy the night. I think tonight is like a light show or something. So it should be a good night. And let me show you my um, outfit real quick. Okay, so this is my dress rehearsal dress and the shoes that I'm wearing are from Amazon's The Drop. Just some little block heel sandals. They're actually really comfortable. They have like a suede material to them. And if you can see the back of this dress, it has a little cutout, it's so pretty. And I just feel like it's super flattering. The cow I love the cow neck on this dress. But yeah, and I'm going to bring my little bamboo um, handbag with me and my hair, as you just saw. I just did like a slick back pony because we don't know how the weather's going to hold up, but I'm really excited for these photos. So I will try to get some footage of us taking the photos. I'm sorry that this lighting keeps like going in and out. I think it's the weather and the sun that we keep getting like sun in and out of the room all day so I apologize but I will try to get some footage of the photo shoot I'll try to like prop my camera up somewhere also again depends on the weather because the photos are outside so we'll see how it goes but um show them your outfit where's the shirt from here <laughs> He yeah, actually just found this shirt in the gift shop and the shorts, hold on, the lighting is like not cooperating here. The shorts, where are the shorts from? Are those Club Monaco's. Club Monaco, that's right. Shoes are Kohans. Sorry, the lighting is crazy in here. So we went and did our photos and I couldn't film any of it because the photographer had us moving from like one place to another all over the resort really quickly and it was like boom, 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 really fast. But we went back to the room, got changed into casual clothes, so just in like shorts and a tank. And we just went to one restaurant shop for dinner and now we came to another for dessert. So, it's a lot. Hello. Always on his phone. So we're gonna eat dessert, which I will show you. I'm gonna order a, it's called meringue en agroom, if I'm saying that right. It's French, don't know. Citrus custard, meringue, chantilly cream, and a candied zest. Sounds so yummy. And then after that, we're just gonna walk around. It gets really dark here really early. Like it started getting dark around like seven o'clock, but we're just going to kind of walk around. There's supposed to be like a light show that starts later on. So we're going to check that out and just enjoy the rest of the night and then get to bed pretty early. We have a cruise tomorrow, which I am so excited to take you guys on with me. Um, we're going to go around the mountain and do like a mud bath. Um, there's like a waterfall. There's all sorts of things that we're doing tomorrow. So I'm really excited for that. So lots of exciting things happening. Dessert we've got here, and this is the meringue, and it looks mm. so good. Oh my god! And I wow. can't wait. And we've all got creme brulee. Mm. How is it, babe? Oh um, magnif magnificent! <laughs> so I'm gonna eat this, and then we're gonna go walk around some more.
now Tuesday morning. I had to think of that. Uh, when I'm on vacation, I like can never remember what day of the week it is. I'm just, I'm not paying attention to time, days of the week or anything. I'm just going with the flow here. So I am ready for our first cruise that we're going on while we're here. They are taking us around the mountain for a bunch of fun things. We're gonna drive by, or ride by, I should say. Um, some celebrity homes, like Oprah has a home on the island here. Um, some other celebrities, I forget who they said. Who else? Or what else are we doing? Um, we're driving by a scene where Pirates of the Caribbean was filmed, um, where like Johnny Depp like salutes a dead pirate that's hanging um, in between like two mountains, I think. Um, and then we're gonna go over to a waterfall and we're gonna take some mud baths and then wash off in a hot spring. We're gonna go snorkeling and do a whole bunch of fun things. So I will bring you along for this fun-filled day. I'm so excited. I have no makeup on, but um, it's okay. That's what vacation's all about, right? So I got a little bit of color yesterday, which I'm surprised because yesterday was like so overcast. Um, but I guess that's what they say, like you can still get sun on an overcast day, but we're dealing with it. Um, let me show you my outfit for the day because it's kind of cute and I'm really excited about it. So let me show you. So this is the fit. Sorry that the lighting is like not cooperating in here. I don't know why, but it like kind of like comes and goes, but I have on my big hat that if you saw in the hall, my mother-in-law had this made and it was a bridal shower gift for me. On the back, um, written, I guess it's like woven in there. Um, it says my last name, this is Mrs. Pappas, my married last name. Then I have on this, here we go, there's some light. This oversized shirt, it said, it's um, like kind of going with like that coastal grandmother look, the blue and white striped linen. This set I got from TJ Maxx, um, it was only like 15 bucks. Love that, we love a good deal. And I, I hate that this light keeps going in and out. I'm so sorry guys. New here, still trying to figure this out. And my swimsuit, this was from Amazon, just a cute little one piece deal with the removable belt and my slides I have on my pillow slides since we're gonna be on a boat I wanted something that was comfortable and that I wasn't gonna like slip and slide around in so go with the comfy slides and then I'm going to bring my straw bag with me just because I wanted to be able to bring my camera and bring sunscreen just bring all the things so i wanted to make sure i was prepared and that's pretty much it so we're gonna go grab breakfast first before we have to meet the guy on the pier and head off for our afternoon cruise and we'll be back by two after which i'm sure we'll sit by the pool for a bit or by the beach i'm not sure which we tend to like the pool better than the beach um but i think today i might want to switch it up a bit and go lay by the beach so we'll see i will catch up with you guys in a bit
cruise that we did earlier today and oh my god it was amazing I can't even like begin to describe it they took us all around well not completely around the island but like most of the way we got to see the one scene in well the part where they filmed a scene in Pirates of the Caribbean where there is like a uh, pirate or like a dead pirate hanging we actually like drove under it it was actually really cool um, and then we did this whole like mud bath thing um, and rinsed off in a hot spring we got to stand underneath of a waterfall I mean the things that we did today it was like it was like the stuff that you dream about on a honeymoon like I swear I mean it was just and the views everywhere were absolutely breathtaking I mean I am just feeling so lucky and so blessed that we get to do this and I don't want to I don't want to go home at this point um, we're just we're really enjoying our time here and we just feel so relaxed and so we are getting ready to leave for dinner we have a reservation at a I think it's like a Japanese place I don't know if it's like a hibachi style or just like overall Japanese cuisine but we will find out. So let me show you what I am wearing. So I just went pretty casual tonight, um, just a white crop top. And then I have my Princess Polly wide-legged pants on. And that's it, and just some flats. So very casual. And then, because it is still so sunny out, Got my Ray Vans. So we are gonna go grab dinner and see what the theme of tonight is. They actually canceled last night because of the weather. Um, like I said, it was rainy all day yesterday. Yesterday was kind of just a wash. So they canceled the light show last night because of the weather, which was fine. Um, but it's supposed to be beautiful for the rest of the week and we leave on Friday. So yeah. Um, I will bring my camera with me to dinner so that you guys can see that experience and see what tonight's show is um, that they are having for us. So, I hope you guys are enjoying the vlog as much as we are enjoying this vacation. So. resort at nighttime and like getting any footage of what we do at night but I think that's because my bag that I brought with me like my purse doesn't fit my camera so every time I go to get ready and then like pack up all my stuff to start walking around and go to wherever we're going dinner or wherever I'm just like ah screw it I'm not bringing my camera because I don't want it to get damaged or whatever and then I just I'm so focused on enjoying the moment and just making sure that like I'm having fun and just being present with my husband so I'm so sorry that like I haven't gotten any footage of dinner or like any of the shows or anything else that's been going on at night time around here I will make sure that I bring my camera tonight because today is my birthday I am 35 today um, so today we are, I think we're going to start just by going to the gym. They do have a fitness center here. So I want to get in on a nice little workout. And then we are going to go sit on the beach or by the pool. That's like typically what we do during the day if we don't have any excursions planned. And at night we have a, um, a sunset cruise. And then as soon as we get back from the cruise, we have a little candlelit dinner, private candlelit dinner on the beach for my birthday. So I will definitely be bringing my camera tonight um, to film those. So I apologize that I haven't been the best vlogger. 
this whole trip. But um, I did at least get a lot of good footage on my phone, so I'll be sure to insert those clips from yesterday's um, yesterday's Sue Frere um, Sue Frere cruise, and that was so much fun. Oh my gosh! Um, so I will definitely insert those clips for you guys because it was like the views were just like I said before; they were just breathtaking and. Definitely not something that you would see anywhere else, so. But we are having so much fun on this trip. I don't want it to end. I don't want to go home. But I am going to drink my coffee, try to wake up, and go get a workout in. I haven't worked out in so long. This is actually going to be like another video for in the future, but I have been having some like health issues lately where I haven't had like any energy and I've had some blood work done so I'll be discussing that like in a further video down the road but I haven't been to the gym in like weeks and it's so not like me so when we get back from this trip I'm so looking forward to just getting into like a really good gym routine and just getting back to normal so cheers I'm gonna drink my coffee and get my birthday started Starting off with this yummy breakfast this morning. Got some watermelon, cantaloupe and honeydew, mango, croissant, and of course, what is a morning without starting off with some coffee? 
it's our last morning here, you guys. I am so sad. I like don't want to leave this place. I mean, I will never get tired of these views. This is just insane. But we have one last catamaran cruise today for six hours and then we head home tomorrow morning. It's been an amazing honeymoon. Last night was an amazing birthday, but I'm gonna enjoy my breakfast before this cruise. The last night of the honeymoon, we're on our way to dinner. We're really sad. <laughs> I think the only thing that we're looking forward to when we get home is seeing the puppy and snuggling with him. But we have had the best time on this honeymoon and I couldn't have pictured a, a better vacation. Everything has been amazing. The excursions, the experiences, everything. I will have to do like a little sit down and talk about it when I get home. But we're on our way to like a nice international, they call it dinner. And I'm just wearing a button down with my a Goldie shorts. And I'm carrying my bamboo purse. And we're just gonna go enjoy dinner. And then we have to pack because we leave super early in the morning. It's gonna be another long travel day. It's like a five hour flight. And then we have another, are we going the wrong way? Going the wrong way. Then we have another like two and a half hour drive home from JFK to Philly. So sad day today and a long day tomorrow, but back to reality. So I'll catch up with you guys later. We're gonna miss this place, but it's time to go. So thank you guys so much for joining us and I hope you enjoyed it. Currently at the airport, our flight is delayed. We were supposed to leave around noon. Now we're not taking off until around three. So a little frustrating, but it's okay. We'll get home eventually. But I am at this coffee place and it's called Rituals Coffee. Sign kind of looks like Starbucks. I thought that was kind of cute. So I just ordered myself a iced vanilla latte. So I'm waiting for that and got myself a bottle of water. So we're just gonna hang out and wait for our flight.